Hello oh, all, in this video we're going to look at uh, an app called Construction Calculator Pro. Uh, more specifically the block functionality of it. The block material estimator. And what we're going to do is we're going to estimate a 18 foot by 15 foot uh, block building with just block walls. So we can start by going into the block calculator and we can put in our length and height here. Um, our length being the linear length of our walls which would be the 18 feet plus 18 feet because obviously there's two 18 foot walls plus 15 feet plus 15 feet for the two other walls which would give us our 36 plus 30 or 66 feet so you can start by going in here going 66 feet backing out and let's say we have an eight foot high wall by eight feet and this will give us the proper uh, area for our block now another way to do this which might be a little more practical at times especially if you're not very good at math or if you have a little more complex of a uh, building would be to start in the area calculator so let's go ahead and go in there uh, we're going to work on walls so we'll select rectangle at this point we can put in our 18 foot by 8 foot high wall and we can put two because there's obviously two walls of that size we can put our result units in square feet okay so what this is going to give us is our 18 foot wall two of them because obviously there's two of them and it's going to give us result in square feet so now we go ahead and hit equals and this will give us our two walls and now what we can do just hit dismiss we don't want to email it to anyone now this will be keep compounding so we can keep putting walls in here walls in here more and more and it'll give us a total area to put back into our block calculator so in this case we're doing a 15 by 18 foot um, outbuilding so now we'll change this to 15 feet and now we have our two 15 by 8 foot walls so we hit equals again you'll see it's com compounding it's giving us our single wall at 120 feet there's two of them which adds up to 240 square feet and now it's added it on to the other two walls we've done so it's given us a total so now we have our total square footage of our entire building so we've done our calculations in here now we can back out and go into block calculator now we can just click on area because we've already calculated our area calculator pops up we hit the list button which is keeping track of our history and you'll see it's kept track of the last two calculations we did in the area module so it's right here so we'll select that and back out so that's the easier way to do it especially in more complex calculation complex calculations you can just go into your area module calculate a whole ton of areas and then just come back in here and uh, select your area from the calculator's uh, uh, memory or history. Um, openings, uh, let's just say we have a couple windows. We can do this the same. We could have calculated our windows back in the area module and then just uh, clicked on area here, clicked on our list and selected it from our list. But now that you understand that, let's just quick type in, uh, I don't know, 60 square feet for our, our windows back out. So all that's going to do is uh, subtract that from our uh, our main area. Um, settings is your block size. So we have um, 16 by 8 inch block here. Block cost $5 a block and there's going to be a waste percentage of 10%. So that's good. You can put your mortar in there if you want. This is a mortar per number of blocks. So uh, we'll say 100 blocks. Uh, we're going to use a bag of mortar and then we can put in our mortar cost to get cost. So we're all ready to go now, so we can hit the equals button. And this is gonna give us our total number of blocks that we require, the cost of our blocks, total number of bags of mortar required, cost of our mortar, and of course, our total cost. And that's our calculation complete. Uh, of course, uh, once we've done this calculation, we can email it to ourselves to save it. 
And that's about it. Thanks for watching.